to another KDE V5 video tutorial. I want to do a row cage in a quick and dirty way. I've already prepared a mock-up car. You could do this with ribs in the part design, but therefore you would need sketches. I will go for sweeps because I can use sketches, edges, wireframe geometry or extracts as center lines for sweeps. So insert a geometrical set, call it for example extracted lines and activate the extract and extract all the edges you need. one Extracts and I will hide the part body. So, next I have to use sweep and I will use the subtype center radius. Radius will be 3 millimeters. Center curve, let's start with this one and OK. So, in the end, I need solids. So I have to make closed surfaces and I will close this. You could do it with, where is it, with, come on, with fill. That's sort of convenient, but you could use spheres as well. So. I will go for, let's try with fill. You want to fill this one and you want to have a support and support is that. Make it tangent and make a preview. And okay, so that might be too big. So back and go for a sphere. The center, I need an end point of this line. Make it a complete sphere. Sphere radius three millimeters. That's okay. Another sphere. Create end point. and OK. So maybe I should do this in an extra geometrical set, call it barrel simple and move these Simple. Okay. Then I have to split these. I will go for planes. So I need a plane, normal to a curve. Curve is this one, and I need an endpoint. Okay. And another plane. That's the curve. Create an end point. Okay. Then split 
this sphere with this plane and on the other side as well split this sphere with that plane and OK. So I would have to repeat these steps over and over again. So we go for a power copy. First join the sweep, the split, the split and OK. And then you can make a closed surface with this join. As I don't want to repeat it again and again, I will go at first for a power copy. So, I want to have this join. Call it barrel PC power copy. The inputs right now is the sweep, the split, and the split. That's too much. So, I will reduce this by clicking on the inputs I don't want and I come to extract and access system. That's okay. And okay. If you want to instantiate the power copy you have first to save it. Okay, let's check it out. Make sure the geometrical set is activated. It's the working object. There is our power copy. And go for power PC object, instantiate. Let's click this. Select the access system. And there you go. And preview. Looks nice and OK. So that's quite convenient. But your tree will become bigger and bigger. So I will go for a user feature. Therefore, insert knowledge template user feature. Call it barrel feature. For example, you want to have again the join and as input not the sweep, not the split, not the split, not the sphere, not the plane, not the sphere, not the plane. You can rename this. Sorry. Go to inputs. Call this barrel access. And access system is access system, but you could rename it as well. Just access system. Yeah, go to properties and I will use black box protected and OK. Just save it. And let's make a new geometrical set. Call it barrel featured. And go to our knowledge template folder. There you go. Well, feature object, instantiate. Select this and the access system. Make a preview. Nice. And maybe another one. Let's try this one. Access system. Take a look. OK. That's nice. Now I will insert another body and rename this one to Roll Cage. It's the working object. I will change to part design. It's still the working object and I will make closed surfaces from these. Let's open it. So I want to have a 
closed surface from the first join, okay, closed surface from the second join, yep, okay, and from these two, that's it, then I will hide, so you get the closed surfaces right here, I will hide these two barrel features and the two joints, or maybe, yeah, I could hide this complete set. Yeah, so let's go back to shape design and make this the working object. No. And instantiate this one, exosystem preview, okay. So you still have to repeat all these steps. So there is another useful option. Make sure barrel featured is in work object. Go to your barrel feature, instantiate it, and there is an option repeat, which beats after OK, it will be repeated. So take this axis. Select the access system and preview and OK. And then you see it's already selected, so you don't have to select the access system again and again, just the barrel access. And OK. OK. And OK. And Okay, and okay, and okay, and okay, and okay, okay. So this is really quick and sort of dirty. So this one is missing. That one, this one, and the last one right here, and then cancel it. So I've done all the sweeps. Let's check it out if I can close the surface of all of them. Make a row cage in work object. Change to Part design and now activate close surface. That's okay. And okay, okay, okay. Hopefully, I didn't miss one. Okay, there's one which doesn't work, the last one. I have to further investigate this but all the others worked, so I can hide them. It's okay. 
don't know what the problem with the last one is, so maybe I will delete this one. And I see I have missed this. So go back to barrel feature, definable object, and at least make this. Select the access system and OK. It's worked. Try to close it. Okay, this worked as well. So there's one small problem with this line. So this is sort of a problem. I will try to solve it with a new body. So I will insert a new body. Where you go. You could have done all these closed surfaces in a separate body and make this one the work object, instantiate the barrel feature, and take this axis. And OK, this works. And now let's try to close it in a new body. Close this one. And it works. OK. So, but there is still a problem because I cannot add these two bodies together. So I might have to change my mock-up car to solve this problem. But the barrel feature and the power copy worked fine. So I hope you enjoy this video. Maybe I show the mock-up and give it a different color yeah and I could finally mir mirror these two bodies so mirror it on the plane Okay, and mirror this as well. Okay, and you see it's sort of a roll cage. I'm done for today. See you next time. Bye bye.